is a Google Pixel Slate and you have an issue where you have a black screen, even though you have a black screen, you know that the tablet is still on. Okay, I'm going to give you several options to get you up and running right now. By the end of this video, at least 70% of you guys should be up and running, okay? Okay, so this one is obviously fixed, but we're going to pretend we have a black screen, okay? So first thing I want you to do is go ahead and restart it using only the power button, okay? So let's pretend my screen here is totally black. So first thing is go to your power button and press and hold for 10 seconds. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now it's totally off. Now we're gonna count 10 seconds again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now turn it back on, just tap the power button and now just wait till it turns back on. And hopefully you are now out of the black screen. Okay, if you're still in the black screen, then we're going to go to the next option to fix. Okay, so you still have a black screen, no problem. So what we want to do next is, uh, also, if you have a case or anything on here, take the case off. Okay, we want the um, we want this slate to be naked. All right, no case or nothing on here. Okay, so second thing is this. So you have the power button here. What I, first, what I want you to do is spam the power button. Press the power button in, like maybe like three, four, or five times, like that. Okay, now. Go ahead and grab your charging cable and plug in your slate here. It doesn't matter. You can plug it in there or plug it in there. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to plug it in here. So as soon as I plug it in, now we should see a red solid light. Okay. So red solid light. And now let's let it charge for about like five, ten seconds. After that, what we want to do, the same thing with the power button. Okay. So again, let's pretend my screen here is totally black while it is plugged in charging. Here's the power button. Ready? Do it again. 10 seconds. Ready? Set. Go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It's totally off. Now let go. Now count the 10 seconds. Again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now just turn the tablet back on. Just tap it, the power button, and now just wait for the boot back up and hopefully you can see this screen here hopefully your screen turns on okay if not we're going to go to the next step here okay so you still have a black screen no problem so from here we can go ahead and unplug it and next thing we're going to do now is what I call the tap method okay so what we're going to do is we're going to tap all over the screen and all over the back okay again let's pretend like my screen here is black okay so grab two fingers like this what you want to do is tap kind of hard all over the screen and sometimes as you're doing this, you may get white lines, you may get like half a screen might turn on or whatnot. But anyway, just keep tapping all over, okay? The whole basis behind this is you might have like a little ribbon slightly dislodged and a little tap can pop it right back into place, believe it or not, okay? So just tap all over on the screen, guys, all over. You can even put it flat surface and you can even use two fingers. Just keep tapping. And now turn it over on the back side as well, okay? Do the same thing here. You gotta tap kind of hard, okay? All over. Keep on going. Okay? Now turn it over, tap on the power button, and see if your screen is on now. If it's still off, no problem. From here, we're gonna use that power button. Press and hold for 10 seconds again, okay? 10 seconds again. 10 seconds again, sorry. Okay, ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10. Go ahead and let go. Count to 10 seconds again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now just turn it back on. Just tap. And now wait for it to turn back on. And hopefully you see the screen and your screen is now up and running. If you're still down, we're going to go to the next possible solution. Okay, so your screen is still black, no problem. Okay, so what we're gonna do next is, is what I call the massage method. What we're gonna do is massage all over on the screen and all over on the back, okay? And there's the same premise as uh, tapping. You may have a ribbon or a cable slightly dislodged, okay? And a little press can pop it back into place. Uh, we're gonna start off on the screen here. You can use a cloth or a paper towel or something if you don't wanna smudge up your screen. But basically what I want you to do is hold, hold the uh, tablet like this and I want you to press on the screen like this, press. Press, press, all over, press. If it's too big, just put it down, flat on the desk, press. Give it like a nice massage, press. Press, press, press. Keep on going, keep on pressing, keep on pressing. 
nice massage all over, even on the bottom, the sides. And then from here, I mean, as you're, as you're pressing in, sometimes the screen will pop on or half the screen, you might get white lines. So after you press all over the screen, just tap on the power button and see if it, your screen turns off. It's still off, no problem. Then we're going to do the back side here as well, okay? We're going to press, press. I like to do it like this. Press, 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 all over, all over, press. Give it a nice massage all over. Turn it over. Tap that power button and see if your screen is on. If it's still off, no problem from here. Again, while the screen is black, we're going to press and hold the power button for 10 seconds. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four. Pretend my screen is black, all right? Eight, nine, ten. Let go. Count 10 seconds again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now simply tap it, the power button, to turn it back on, and wait one second. Hopefully, you'll be able to see this right here with the Google logo. All right? If not, we're going to go to the next possible solution, okay? So your screen is still black, no problem. Let's pretend my screen is black here. So the next thing what I want you to do here is what I call the smack method, okay? The same premise behind the tapping and the massage. You may have a ribbon or cable slightly disconnected, okay? So with the smack method... Basically, we're going to smack the screen with the palm of our hands, okay? So you can use a rag if you don't want to smudge up your screen, but it doesn't matter what side you start off on. We'll start off on the screen side here and just put your palm out like that. And you want to give it a couple of whacks. Also on the bottom of the screen as well. You can turn it over, tap on the power button, see if your screen is on. If it's not, no problem. Now we're going to go ahead and just smack the back. All right, just smack the back. Sometimes you're doing this, the screen might pop on as well, okay? All over in the back and on the top back as well. Okay, now tap the power button and see if your screen is on. If it's still off, no problem. Again, from here, remember, while the screen is black, remember, press and hold that power button for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds, let go. The tablet is off. Wait 10 seconds again after 10 seconds and press it one time to turn it back on, all right? Now, if you're still down after that, the next thing I have for you is what I call the freezer method. So what I want you to do is take your slate, naked, just like this with no case. I want you to go to your freezer and I want you to put this in your freezer where it's nice and cold. Leave it there for 15 to 20 minutes. After 15 to 20 minutes, grab your cold slate out of the freezer and tap on that power button and see if your screen is on, okay? If it's still not coming on while it's nice and cold, do the same thing with the power button again. Remember, press and hold for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds, let go. Count to 10 seconds again. After 10 seconds, then press it one time to turn it back on. Now, the thing is, if you guys tried all of these steps and you still have a black screen, then what I would recommend is starting back from step one. Try, try it again, all the way down. Three times it doesn't work, try four times. Try it up to at least seven times. If you try it at least up to seven times every step, I'm gonna say at least 70% of you guys will now have a working screen. Okay? Good luck, guys.